Since the Civil Defence Academy, CDA, first started its operations in 1999, the infrastructural landscape of Singapore has changed significantly. To remain relevant for emergency response scenarios of tomorrow, the SEDF is enhancing our training grounds to meet the new challenges of the future. The CDA redevelopment project will take place over a period of three years and will include many new and innovative features which will enhance training realism, effectiveness and outcomes. The Emergency Responders Fitness Conditioning and Enhancement Lab, or EXCEL, aims to optimize responders' physiological and psychological performance by focusing on five key areas. The Strength, Conditioning and Rehabilitation in a Virtual Environment, or STRIVE, boasts a motion platform with a 360-degree dome for an immersive environment and provides real-time longitudinal monitoring of various human factors. The environmental chamber simulates the desired climatic conditions in a realistic yet controlled environment for the conduct of the breathing apparatus proficiency test and acclimatization programs. The fitness evaluation lab conducts pre- and post-physiological assessments and designs effective intervention tools for optimal physical fitness and enhanced safety. Periodic screening and testing could also help to identify predisposition to neuromuscular injuries. The Cognitive Lab will have advanced systems to research and develop new cognitive training protocols to enhance responders' cognitive and behavioural performance. CDA also seeks to embrace the digital training through the establishment of the Digital Learning Lab, where responders can learn through extended reality technology without constraints imposed by the physical environment. The Driving Simulator provides responders the opportunity to practice emergency response driving in a safe and controlled environment. The use of data analytics provides insights on a respondent's performance to facilitate targeted or corrective training. The VR Fire Investigation Training System replicates post-fire environments and provides forensic tools for a fully immersive training experience in virtual burn rooms. The VR Fire Fighting Training System teaches trainees the different types of fire phenomena and the corresponding tactical responses required. They will gain valuable experiences in a safe learning environment before facing live fire simulators. The Mixed Reality EMS Training System enhances training realism and allows SCDF paramedics and EMTs to accelerate training of on-scene assessment and pre-hospital treatment protocols. A professional institution that drives Emergency Medical Services, or EMS, training standards and certification needs, the National EMS Training Centre is designed and purpose-built to offer a comprehensive training curriculum that imparts professional medical skills, team-based pre-hospital training, as well as sophisticated scenario-based training that is aimed to emulate the complete pre-hospital care procedures and processes. NETC will leverage state-of-the-art VR and AR technologies to simulate realistic scenarios for our paramedics and EMTs to conduct EMS training in a safe environment. The new CDA will also house the mixed-use premises and the enterprise, featuring mock-ups of metropolitan facilities such as a bus interchange, underground MRT station and shopping mall to facilitate large-scale urban fire and rescue exercises. Designed with input from our specialist units, the facilities prepare responders to undertake complex operations such as urban search and rescue and hazardous materials mitigation. The vehicle tunnel is where responders will be exposed to a wide variety of simulated real-life situations such as a road traffic accident, a vehicle fire or a partial collapse of the tunnel wall. The newly developed FTA will include a fire research centre that enhances SCDF's capabilities by deepening expertise and knowledge in fire science and research and set new benchmarks in evidence-based fire safety standards. The state-of-the-art research facility enables the conduct of comprehensive fire-related studies for SCDF to continually validate and review its fire code requirements and standards to ensure optimal fire safety standards are adopted in Singapore's buildings. There will be an update to the furnace where it will embody a high-rise building to better reflect the latest residential and commercial layouts comprising hostels, hotel rooms, public and private housing.
SCDF believes in developing and empowering its officers. The Leadership Development Centre offers programs that prepares officers to perform in various leadership roles within the organisation. In addition, the centre undertakes disaster management research and transforms knowledge into impact through the conduct of senior executive programs for disaster managers in the region and beyond. With the redevelopment of CDA, we are confident to continue producing professionals and leaders who will be better equipped and ready for any operational challenges of the future. This positions SCDF as a world-leading life-saving force through people, innovation and partnership.